In the summer of 2016, I continued my journey from Pärnu, Estonia to the port city of Ventspils on the northwestern coast of Latvia, which has in recent years become a quite favored holiday destination by many visitors from neighboring countries and elsewhere. In addition to the clean and historic small town, there are tens of kilometers fine sandy beaches in and around the city, which are ideal for outdoors, swimming, fishing and of course, metal detecting. First I headed to the city beach. There I accidentally met another detectorist, a Lithuanian tourist, who had a heavy looking Soviet type detector. We didn't have a common language, so the discussion was short. However, I understood that he hadn't found anything exciting on the beach. On this trip I also wanted to test my new scoop, which I had made using electric conduit, baler and cable ties. It can be used without bending down and since it's all plastic, it doesn't cause unnecessary beeps on the detector. I was amazed at how clean and neat the Latvian beaches were. At some point I even thought the detector was not working correctly, since the beeps were so few, even around the benches and trash bins, which are typically full of bottle caps and aluminum wraps. I tried different places on the beach and nearby dunes, such as beach volleyball courts, but beside few 80s Soviet coins, I didn't find anything worth mentioning. After visiting the city beach, I went to another place about 30 km south of Ventspils. The same cleanliness immediately caught my eye, and the results of a couple of our detecting were pretty much the same than in the city. Perhaps part of the reason is that the coastline of Latvia, like in the rest of the Baltic states, have opened up to the public only after the collapse of the Soviet Union. During the Soviet era, the entire coastline of the Baltic Sea was part of the closed border zone, which was carefully guarded by the Soviet Union to stop their own citizens fleeing the country. As shown in these aerial photos, the Latvian beaches are worth a visit even without great findings. If you love and value the sun, peace and tranquility, you will surely find your own comfortable coal where you can spend a relaxing summer day with or without a detector. Thanks for joining me and see you next time.